In the next half hour, we'll take you back to Plymouth, Massachusetts in 1620. Visit a local turkey farm. We'll meet some Halloween traditionalists and view the wonder of some fabulous fall foliage. I'm your host, Patrick Ryan, and welcome to this edition of Seasons of New England. This is Window to the Fall. And what would Thanksgiving be without a turkey? I don't know. It's unimaginable. This local turkey farm has everyone talking. of ducks, geese, and turkeys makes for a lot of Thanksgiving dinners. Thanksgiving may be fall's most traditional holiday, but Halloween is definitely fall's most exciting holiday. Still to come, we meet up with some Halloween traditionalists who will spook you with some scary sights. Also coming up is our fabulous look at some of New England's prettiest fall foliage and our conclusion to the Plymouth Plantation story. It's all coming up when Seasons of New England, Window to Fall returns after these public service announcements. Fall in New England represents a change in the seasons. Streets are lined with a beautiful array of colors, but within this palette of beauty, there is also a dark side, a time that shadows death and bleeds a picture of winter. And how do the people reflect on this celebration of darkness? Through one night of All Hallows Eve. One of the hottest spots for Halloween costumes this year is East Greenwich's Trolls and Things, where we spoke with Edward Rooney. The store is a big collection of a lot of props, paraphernalia, you know, and of course, what I don't do that much of myself, personally, but a lot of people do, is the gore. So if you look around here, you're going to notice we have all kinds of anatomical parts and cuts and bruises and props for blood and anything else along the line you want. We can be as gruesome as you can visualize. Uh, and we do have clients that come in for that. Our clients over the years have come in and indicated they like one thing or another, so we pay attention to that. And um, we had actually had an association with a guy named David Elbow, who does a fright night in Jamestown. He's been doing it for years. And he had a whole slew of wonderful masks and props that he was prepared Dave to Dave Elbow has been collecting movie masks and props for many years, and on the night of Halloween, he brings his collection to life at Jamestown's House of Horrors. I always liked when you went to a house and somebody decorated it and went out of their way to try to scare you. I tried to take it a step further and scare really good. <coughs> we don't pull any punches. We want to scare people. You know, you go to some of these other haunted houses, they kind of hold back or they're just there goofing around. This we go and we really want to scare people. So in fact, this is this room here is called the Dahmer Deli, after Jeffrey Dahmer. <laughs> <laughs> Growing up, I always liked horror movies, monster movies, and that's when I started seeing that you could buy monster movie masks, and that's what started, you know. The earliest ones I got were like the big predator I've got, um, a Bela Lugosi, I've got a huge alien, which I really like a lot, and then uh, props, I've got a few that were actually used in movies. So. <laughs> I'm hoping eventually to make this a business venture, as far as I'm hoping that maybe someday to make some money off it. Uh, right now, because it's not a legitimate business, I can't charge admission. That's why it's free. But I do pretty well with donations for the, you know, Coming out of the goddamn wall, what the fuck? Well, I appreciate you guys coming by. Hope this project goes well for you. All right, take care of yourself. <laughs> Halloween. The spirit is still alive. The tricks, the treats, and the thrill of the scare, that's the fun and excitement of Halloween. Now what would the fall season be without the turning colors of the leaves? It wouldn't be a traditional New England fall. Delight your senses with nature's own art show. The most fantastic sights and sounds the fall season in New England has to offer. Times change, as do the seasons here in New England. I hope you've enjoyed looking through our window to fall. I'm Pat Ryan. Good night. <laughs>